because we are losing our own identity. In my childhood, even on the streets, if an Adventist walked, we could say he is an Adventist, she is an Adventist. Now we don't know who is who. The world has come so much into the church, we don't know. 200 years ago, a preacher by the name of Horatius Bona from Scotland said, I looked for the church and I found it in the world. And I looked for the world and I found it in the church. And he said, a worldly church can never save the world for Christ. 200 years ago, how true is it today? We want to be like the world to win the world. That is a bad strategy. God has called us to be different and unique. If somebody has to follow me, they should see something in me that they don't have. Otherwise, why should they follow me? The world doesn't see any better off in Christianity. Because Christians, divorce rate is the same, abusive rate is the same, worldliness is the same. What difference do we make in the world? So why should they follow us? Some of the most loving people are not churchgoers. Do you know that? When you have a problem, you don't come to a church member, you go to the outsider. Because you believe if you tell the church, the whole world will know. I have been in this business for 23 years, so I know what I'm talking about. Until we are different and unique, we are going to be here. I always say this, we are going to hell through the church. This is such a comfortable place to make us feel good, but we are going nowhere unless there is a total transformation from within. Adventists were known to be the people of the book, were known to be, not anymore, because we are not studying. We are not opening our word properly. We are depending on WhatsApp devotions, forwarded devotions, a sermon on a Sabbath or a YouTube sermon. When was it last you opened your Bible and meditated it for your own soul?